please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning. Today is Tuesday, April 7th. I'm Enthusiastic Eric. Prom signups are currently happening in the morning in Mr. Culp's room and during the junior-senior lunch period. Any high school TSA member competing at the state competition, please see Mr. DeZerko at your, at your earliest convenience. There will be a mandatory History Club meeting Thursday, April 9th at 2.30 in Mr. Berkey's room. We will be distributing permission slips, medical forms, and payment information for our field trip. You must be there. Today for lunch, we'll be having Casa's Pizza, Steamed Broccoli and Cheese, Fresh Fruit, and Mini Pretzels. Tomorrow for breakfast, we'll be having Apple Fruitle, Cereal, Milk, and Fruit Juice. Thanks, and have a fantastic day. Good morning. I'm Randy Ryan here with your Wimber weather. Today, it will be cloudy with a chance of rain and highs will reach 66, and overnight, it will be cloudy with a possible thunderstorm and lows will drop to 51. Tomorrow, it will be cloudy with a chance of rain and highs will reach 60, and overnight, it will be cloudy with lows dropping to 31. Thanks, and have a great day. The word of the day is capricious, impulsive, or unpredictable. The court ruled that the punishment was arbitrary and capricious. This month, we're going to learn some tips and tricks that will be helpful in finding and keeping a job. Did you know that there are certain words and phrases in resumes and cover letters that employers use to locate and to screen out applicants? Over the course of this month, you will learn how to improve your chances of getting a job. Yesterday, in 1896, the first modern Olympics were held in Athens, Greece. Today, in 1994, a civil war erupted in Rwanda. Margaret Thatcher, the first female Prime Minister of the United Kingdom, died on April 8, 2013. On April 9, 1865, Robert E. Lee surrenders, ultimately ending the Civil War. On April 10, 1942, the Bataan Death March began. Thanks, and have a great week. Hi, I'm Breezy Braden. I'm here with, what's your name? Logan. Logan. How was your weekend, Logan? Good. How was yours? Pretty good. We are not brothers, because everybody on the news team apparently thinks that we look alike. Okay, I'm going to ask you the first question. Are right. you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. How many states does Vermont border? Two? Three. <laughs> Where is the space bar on a typewriter? The top, the bottom, left, or right? The bottom. Yeah, you're right. It's Hi, bottom. Fitz. How was your weekend? It was aight. You sure? Yeah, a little rough one, but you know, I'm still here. Okay. Well, I'm going to ask you the first question. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. What does PTA stand for? Uh. Parent Teacher Association. Correct. What what creature can have as many as 710 legs? Not a centipede, that's 100. Um, pass. Right. It's a millipede. Oh, that makes sense. Hey. Yeah. Wah, wah, wah. I'm waking up.